hi there this is my android head unit and now looking at this google play store win x launcher let's click it on install and check out the screenshots yeah it looks like a uh, windows yeah you can see the start button and the, the apps over here and yeah it, it actually looks like a windows but it works on android tablet or it can be an android head unit it's now installed let's open it okay you can actually set this at a default home app um, i'm not going to do that i'm just going to cancel and there you go it's already there so you have this pc chrome it, it looks like windows yeah and when you click here it's a start button and you get to see all your apps over here interesting this is so similar you know to to what you do on your pc yeah so this is your contact this is your wi-fi wow this is really interesting yeah permission required okay so i just need to use the winx launcher um allow do not disturb okay there you go wow interesting okay um then you have this battery this is always connected so you don't have to worry about that then you have the date wow okay this is easy to understand and here this is notifications this is exactly how window looks like and it's so familiar and um, but the thing is um how do i get my apps here let me see click here you can add a widget you can add a shortcut uh, create a folder okay well, let me just add a widget yeah and looks like um nothing much i can do here all these are uh, you know third party third party widgets which i don't really want them to be here i'm really looking for something they have built themselves yeah a widget just uh, such as clock and so on um, at a glance maybe i'll try okay always allow create actually showing you the day and date and month so you click longer take to the next desktop resize delete so let's say i want to this right resize it there is nothing i can do oh, okay i can actually place it like this okay i'm just resize resizing it okay so click it so it's stuck here yep what if i want to add a button a shortcut uh -huh. so i can choose the activities i follow the driving mode driving mode interesting this is google map it's actually just a shortcut to my google map i'm gonna just remove it from the desktop and what other things i can do here i can also add I can also add um, setting shortcuts, share location, sound search, traffic, and whatnot. Okay, let me see if I can see all my apps here. Can I just pull it out? Let me just try. Yeah. So, for example, I have this uh, Chrome. Uh, Chrome is there already. Ah, I have this music. Can I just drag it out? Oh, that's simple. I can just drag it out. My map can be here. Just click here. Oh, okay. When I click longer, it actually shows what you can do. Add to desktop, you can pin it, you can rename it, uninstall it, and whatnot. So I can just add it to the desktop. Actually, pretty user friendly, yeah. Because especially if you, uh, you know, uh, from from a windows or pc based uh, user this is pretty easy to understand so okay so what's what's next let's see what i can do with the settings here um this these three lines what does it do okay you can reset the size start panel 
I get resize, I get build subscriptions, see the background pictures, Android settings, and some personalization. Well, okay, this is dark mode, light mode. Oh, I it requires premium subscription. Nope. Just, just dark mode will do then. Then the style can be Windows 10, modern Windows 11, which required me to go for subscription as well. Transparency. Okay. Actually, I. I, I kind of like less transparency, yeah, so I can see the things cl clearer. So this is good. Um, pick team from color, team color. Um, I just I'm not gonna change anything on that. I do hope that I can make the icon bigger, yeah, but um, it looks like it don't have that here. Okay, next will be the background. Well, provided by this dot windows www.paxos.com. Okay, let's just try. Yeah, interesting. Maybe back to something simple. Yeah, it looks good. So I'm just gonna keep to that. Um, okay, next would be default dark color. Blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Oh, grid width. I see. Two, three, four, five. Okay. Um, grid height. App icon size. Interesting. Let me just make it bigger. The biggest. How, how big can you grow? Okay, 101 dp. Okay, that's good. Close it. Oh my gosh, what's happening? Can I just, you know, move it here? Yes, I can. Let's just move it around, yeah? Don't, they're not putting all together. Oh, this is. I can just delete this. There you go. This PC, what is that? Oh, it shows my hard drive, my extended drive. Interesting. And also the apps that I have. Okay. Um, let's see what else I can do. Yeah. I was somewhere here. Uh, pictures, Android settings, personalize. I'm done with personalize. Let's click here. This is a subscription. I'm gonna cancel it. I'm not gonna pay for anything yet until I really tested it. And if I like it, then only I'll start paying. So this is pictures where you can, you know, access to your uh, internal storage to to see what you can actually put here. In the pictures here, and this is settings, which is going to your Android settings. And next would be this. Not sure what is that. Personalize. Actually, the same thing. Yeah, you see earlier. This, this is the information of this app. Yeah, it's been X launched with no ads, which is great. Yeah, it's free. So let me just see what else I can do here. I can. Oh, I can actually go to the personalize right here. We are going through these settings. Interesting. It's just like Windows. Uh, you know, Microsoft. Where you can have different ways of accessing, you know, the settings and so on. That's good. That's good. You can also auto hide the taskbar, which is exactly what I want. You know. Yeah. So you don't see all this. If you like this, just give me a thumbs up. All right. Thanks for watching and bye.